Are, are you using the camera as a mirror? Are you filming? Yeah. Jeez, really? I'm just trying to... I film, it's what I do. Fix your hair. Let me like... move the camera also. So, <laughs> what this is, besides lawn noise, is our ver are you in the picture you're not in the picture what? yeah i'm in the picture Woo -hoo. hang on stop trying to be so leisurely and sit down just stand up i wanted to sit yeah well you're not gonna um i'm a leisure enthusiast i ain't that the truth <laughs> so you've seen a lot of this stuff this time of year where youtube channels do like the best gifts for a biker and i was like well and I watch it a lot of them. Some of them I completely agree on, and some of them I'm like, I, I think I have some better, not better, let's not say better, different ideas. So let's get into that. I have, a, I have a Christmas gift idea for those people. <laughs> some people just walk by walking their kid. We just took breaks from our real jobs going to get a job. There's your Christmas idea. Go get a job so you don't have to screw around during the, well, I'm screw. Wow. What, during Grinch? The day. Yeah? Really? Rich. Grinch. Oh, they said rich. Anyway, Green. so we have a list of stuff that I'm like, I use all the time that I'm big believers in. And, and I said, hey, we should do our list. So you come up with stuff, I'll come up with stuff. And we may not have compared notes well because mine are actual things. So are mine. That people would want. Mine are actual things. She thought I was kidding. And her list of what a half dozen things is Look. not, okay, they're very serious. It's very serious stuff. I'm getting you most of this stuff, so I Yeah, you're already using it, I evidently. hope you enjoy it. We live in South Florida, anyway. So number one, I'll put pictures. What I'll do is I'll put pictures up in the middle because I had this stuff everywhere and I don't want to tear the damn garage apart to get it. Sorry. So, um, tie-down straps. I think the tie-down straps are always a mess. Everyone I know, theirs are always tied in knots. Yeah. It's a, they're junk, they're not strong enough. I, I can tell you a story about when we moved my father down here he bought cheap tie-down straps, and his frickin' Dyna broke loose and fell over on the trailer, and we were pulling pulling it with an RV with no back window, and we didn't know. And we got a dude flagging us down because the bike's just doing this now. Anyway, so good tie-down straps. I'll put a link and stuff, but I use Rhinos. They're American-made, family-owned, good company. Um, I have the ratchet straps, and I have uh, the pull tights. I use the pull tights, the simple ones, for the back wheel. This is not as much of a thing. I'm going into too much detail here, but I'll put links. So I use Rhino tie-down straps. They have different price points and stuff and links and all that, but I think that's a good gift for a motorcyclist, like some decent straps to get rid of the junk they probably have. Yeah. Um, and you go ahead with your second one. Um, my Well, my first one is um, a crochet beard because let me tell you why. Let me tell me why. See, what happened was if you go riding uh -huh. in cold weather and you don't wear a full face, you may need to protect. So that's a thing? It's a thing. It's a, a beard that you wear and it's crocheted. So it'll protect all this loveliness. I'll and put a picture up. Now somebody needs to take a drink. So crochet now, beard. Now back to actual stuff. Yeah. Um, I've seen this in other videos and I'm a big believer in this, mm -hmm. uh, is the little tire inflators. I'll put a picture and a link and all that stuff. All the links will be in the description for all yeah. that stuff. But uh, I have the Fantic one. It's the one I did a video on because I have bought three of them over the last couple of years and I keep giving away to friends when they have a tire that's going flat. But um, I'll put a handy. picture and I'll in the link again, all that stuff's down below, but the Fantic tire inflator is one of my favorite things. It does not leave my tour pack. No. Um, unless I'm charging it, which is USB, which is cool. Yeah. And you, yeah. So the next thing is a beer mitt. <laughs> well, I'm drinking Coke Zero, not a sponsor, but uh, it's a beer mitt. So it's a nippy night. You're having a few beverages and uh, it, they're cold in your hands. So what you do is you, you get this pyramid. That looks so inappropriate. I love it. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> and and it doubles as a puppet. Wah, wah, wah. Yeah, okay. And you put your drink in there and there you go. It's an essential for every biker in cold weather. You wear yeah. that. It's some like, yeah, wear that. Uh, uh, the the uh, northernmost. Yeah. Anyway. Someone's going to be like, what? Oh, they're going to think you're brilliant. And by like, the way, I'm sending these to Dallas. So this, I'm going to show. Let me stop the video because I am going to show one thing because I like this thing a lot. Forget it. Somebody parked their bike so close to the Chola, I can't get it off. Um, is a, a really cool oil. I, I love hard to find things you don't see as often. And you can get this on Amazon, but it's from a smaller shop. They have an Amazon store, so I'll put the link. But put a picture right here. I'm not gonna say it, because someone gave me coaching the other day that cursing might be hurting the channel. I don't know, but it's effing oil. 
It's an oil plug, uh, 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 plug, oil cap for soft tails that says effing oil and it's brass. And you can get it in silver or black or edge cut and, and it doesn't have to say effing oil, you can just say oil. But they're just really cool little details. Not cheap, but they're made in small quantities. You're not gonna see another one of bike night and anything, you're not gonna see another one of bike night ain't gonna be cheap. But it's it's really cool stuff. I'm a huge fan of the of the company that makes them, so I'll put that link, but you know, good people. Yeah. And you next, madam. I have a buttress pillow. Are you gonna put a picture? I guess. Yeah, what? so it is a it is a pillow, uh -huh. a comfy pillow, which we could all use, and right. it is shaped like a bottom. Which I can't say it's an ass pillow. I can't. No, you just said you weren't gonna curse on. I'm just saying it's it's an ass no, pillow. No, it's not. It's a buttress pillow. Well, it's I haven't just, even seen it yet, but I'll I'll. It's put, something you guys could cuddle up to. <laughs> cuddle up to a big ass. Anyway. Oh. T <laughs> um, another thing that I've used on every bike. If you don't have them, I really think everybody needs them, and that's floorboard spacers. Mine are Kiriak, and we run them on her bike on the Scarlet Harlot and I have it on the Douchebagger, but they're just basically longer hardware and spacers that will move your floorboards out about an inch or an inch and a half. And it really makes a difference. You don't realize, you know, you get a little more room to move around going on the highway if you got those on there, but Kiriak and floorboard spacers. Again, I'll put the link in the description, yeah. you know, that stuff, so yeah. And the, madam? Uh, I think it's important to occupy your time. So kids nowadays have fidget spinners. Kids these days. These darn kids. So we have finger puppets, and I, I assume he's going to put a we, picture, right? We don't have right, finger puppets. But we got some for the baby. We're going to put a picture, like, just right here. The baby's here. 10. Can, can you put the picture right here? Like, right, like, yeah. So they're little finger Over puppets. My face? I'm just saying, just so they could get a real, you know, feel for it. You do so you, you put them on your fingers, and they're little finger puppets, and really, they help pass the time. Maybe at a red light. Actually, I can see drunks play with them at rallies. Maybe at a rally. Maybe yeah. when you're trying to, you know... I don't know. Get through a conversation where you're growing. You don't really interest in what you're saying. You just go. Wah, 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 wah. So finger that, puppets, and they true. come in all animals. So if you want a little squirrel, how long are we gonna spend on the finger puppets? I think it's important they know that they have options. Okay. So there you go, finger puppets. You've got options. <laughs> um, so the next one I think is super practical. I think most people don't use these, and I think they should. Finger puppets? Uh, no. Oh. Uh, I think it's a good stocking stuffer, all that. And if you have a loved one Ooh. that has a Harley or any motorcycle. Um, we all run biker bells, right? You know what a biker bell is, then you know, look that up, but it's a bell you put on your bike. It's always a gift, you never buy your own, and it scares the bad gremlins off your bike. It's a safety thing, it's a ritual, it's important stuff. Anyway, biker bells are always on a bike with zip ties, or don't use the little leather string thing oh, that's often never. on the bell. Those things, if you ride in the rain and stuff, they dissolve and it falls off. Yeah. If you lose your bell, you're in danger. So. Uh, there actually is a metal hanger for the biker bell. I'll put a picture here. Super simple. You pick a bolt. It's got to be, by the way, your biker bell has to be on the lowest point of your motorcycle. Yeah. That's the, that's the rules. Because um, it draws the gremlins under and they run they, over. They fall, well, yeah, you, they fall off because the sound of the bell and you drive over the gremlins. That's the go. thing. But um, this is a little bracket, comes with a key ring, and, and you just take a, a bolt, like let's say a, a floorboard mount bolt out, and that goes through the big end. Mm -hmm. Of, uh, of this bracket and then you just hang your belt. It's the simplest thing on earth. You may be able to make one, yeah. but don't hang your biker belt with a zip tie or that little leather string. It's gonna come yeah. off. This is a good way to do it. Yeah. No relationship. It's just a good product that I have on all our bikes. Yeah, so. somebody texted me the other day on Instagram about that. My bell fell off and I go, well, how are you putting it and on? How'd you put it on? Leather strap that came with the belt. Yeah, like, no, those dissolve. Don't do that. So, go to town. Ready? Yeah, I'm oh, really yeah. excited about this one. You're gonna, you're gonna, okay. So it is a real life life real life it is an idaho potato with your face on it ready yeah okay. no i don't know about this it's you a potato said real, you said real life potato it's head, a but potato what are... no it's a potato an actual idaho we, potato. we've established it's a potato did you get that what? it's a potato do they carve your face on it they'll put your picture on it yeah we need to Give insert someone the a picture. gift that will rot wait and now so stay or still you can cook and eat it. let's put the picture right here again so that they could get a real idea of what the potato is going to look like. So potato, your face on it, a loved one's face on it, girlfriend. Yeah, I went boyfriend. practical, and she went vegetable. Or you could put it. like an ex's face on it and fry it, and just really, you know, <laughs> that's <laughs> okay. it. Okay. Next. Um, the adhesive back zip tie mounts, and those have a name, and I never remember what they are. Another practical thing, throwing somebody's stocking. I'm telling you what, if you own a motorcycle, you got wars. 
and the wires need to be secured. And what these are are little squares with really good 3M backing tape on them. And on the front of the square is a loop yeah. that is perfect for a zip tie to go through. Yeah. So you're basically creating a mounting point for wires on any flat surface. You might be able to find them that have a curve to them. I don't know. Square I only lights. use them that are that are that are square. But like if you put a, if you run I'm looking at her bike right now. The turn signals that mount on the back of the of the of the uh, uh, saddlebag, mm -hmm. they'll come with some of these, but not enough. Yeah. And so you, I use 96 of them when you need when they give you like two. But basically, the whole point is it's a place to secure a wire where there isn't a permanent mounting point, and that's they're like 10 bucks for yeah. a bag, and they come with the zip ties and everything. But I'll put a picture and a link. But you need these. They saw us use them. If you go back to my lights video. When I was working on the lights on the CVO, yeah, you'll see that we use them there, yeah, and it was yeah. great. They're a really good thing to have in the toolbox. Yeah. Um, Go to town. This one's good. This one's another one. Not as good as the potato. It's a boyfriend or girlfriend pillow. Do they have a girl one, or are you telling all the dudes No, I believe they up? have a girlfriend. Because let's be honest, about 5% of you out there are female, but this is 95%. Dude, this is a giant sausage fest. Look, if you want, I, like... So they have a girlfriend pillow. Yeah, they have a girl... I believe... I saw a They might want a boyfriend pillow. Yeah. I'm not judging. It's 2022. Well, it could be... But, you know. Maybe your kid wants a pillow of his sibling. I don't know. It's, it's Pillow a of boyfriend. his sibling? That just got weird. Yeah, it did get weird, didn't okay. it? Okay. So it's a boyfriend they call it a boyfriend pillow you get the image of your yeah, significant really? other pro monkey said get a boyfriend pillow yeah if you want to put pro monkey so on it i don't know oh, i'm just saying you, you want to cuddle Back, up to pro monkey you could get the the potato head the potato head the of me and put it on the right. pillow there yes, you go. There go i think it's um, important for those cold chilly nights you want to cuddle up next one super 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 uh, uh practical you say that like mine weren't a boyfriend pillow isn't as good as this you're leaving for a week i may want to cuddle up photochromatic Transition license or, or, or uh, riding glasses. It's not as cool as a boyfriend pillow. But those are good. So they, they look like they are good. They look like Ray Van Wayfarer style, but they're a transition riding glass. So one of my biggest pains forever ago was always having to carry clears and shades. Yeah. And you're at the, you you start the day with your shades. At the end of the day, you forgot your clears, and it's dark when you're heading home from a, to a, you know from a campground to a campground. And in in certain I'm talking about rally stuff, Daytona Sturgis stuff. If you catch you at night. With dark glasses on, it's a ticket. Yeah. And they're going to breathalyze you and everything else. So I'm going off on a tangent here. But these are really good. So you got good riding glasses that they darken. They really do darken during the day nicely. And then at night, they get really clear. So yeah. those are really good all day long riding glasses. And, and I tried those the other day. Da, da, da. Well, you, you know, the stole them the other day. Well, I borrowed them. The problem is, you also, I ride it with a full face, but. If you put the visor, sometimes it could get, you know, uh, foggy. And I also don't always like the shaded visor. It is hot, so I just like those. Yeah. Um, or if I'm riding without a helmet, uh, don't recommend it. But uh, ready? Yeah. Ready for this? Oh, my God. Grass sandals. Take it in. Take it in. Grass sandals. They are sandals that are covered in artificial turf so that you could get that walking on grass feel without walking on grass. Why would someone do that? Why not? Who doesn't like the feel of walking on grass? Okay. There you go. We're just going to move on. You're welcome. This is a nice simple one, but this is uh, uh, if you have a soft tail or an old, earlier uh, dresser and you don't have a USB port on your bike and you want one, it's the kit that I use to add. It's the exact same kit that I use to put one on uh, the Springer here and on the Cholo bike. So it's just a nice kit. It wires directly to the battery, comes with enough cable, and you can run it up and, and have a nice box with USB on it. You can hide it behind the nacelle up front or something like that, but yeah. practical. There's a picture. Very practical. I mm -hmm. got practical for you. Yep. Inflatable yard cow. Now, I'm behind this one. Yes. I'm on, I'm on board. Behind the cow? I'm, <laughs> I'm on board. You're I'm, on, I'm, you're I'm on board. board for the inflatable for yard cow. Because you imagine you walk by, like, I don't know, I always think of rally stuff. You walk by somebody's campground with their RV and they got a freaking yeah. inflatable cow out front. Yeah. I want to party with that person, you know? And if you put a monkey on top of the cow, now you've got something going. Now you're getting dirty. So, inflatable yard cow. There you go, guys. Uh, another one you've seen in other videos, but it's because it's one of the best damn things a biker would ever own, and that's the NOCO Jump Pack. Uh, I'll put that list on. Wow. Actually, people actually email me going, what was that thing you called? So NOCO is the company. Yeah. They make batteries and cablings and all that stuff, but they have a jump pack that is fantastic. You get different strengths. Mine is strong enough to jump my diesel GMC, so I mean, like, you yeah. can get some, some stronger ones. Uh, but they also sell an adapter you can permanently add to your battery that creates the female of sorts of the jump pack so you're not doing alligator clips. So on a, on a dresser, 
either you get creative with grounding to the starter and all that other stuff, or you got to take the, the, the seat off, the ECM out, that all that crap to get down to the battery. Get and bad. if you just do this one time and add that plug, the plug's always there for you to plug a jump pack in and pow. And then they also have a charger, just a regular battery charger that's good. I did a whole video on NoCo stuff. Yeah. Huge, not a sponsor, but a huge fan of their stuff. Yeah. And we've had those incidents where, actually at Sturgis, where one of the bikes died and we were stuck. Yeah, and actually NOCO makes Harleys, if you didn't yeah. know. So if you buy Harleys Jump Pack, it's a NOCO. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so long story. Ready? Yeah, oh yeah. Okay, Pop-Up Toilet Snake. Mm-hmm. Yep. I once knew a girl named Pop-Up Toilet Snake. Name is Social Security. Yeah. Okay. So, you yeah, put it on your toilet, point. you lift the seat up, and out comes a toilet snake. That's yep. right, for whenever you have friends over, Something just, you know, to impress the girlfriend with. It's just impress it's just, the girlfriend with a pop-up yeah, toilet. Seat. Yeah, see if she has a sense of humor about stuff. Like, ha ha. Oh, you'll find out quick. Yeah, and yeah. if not, maybe you should be making that call. You know, if she can't laugh at a toilet snake, I don't know. Don't you think? Oh, absolutely. Let me tell you. I yeah. Can't begin to yeah. Even, yeah. Or I'd scare your kids too. That'd be fun. Um, last practical one. You know, you just glossed. Although I just, I just, yeah, 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 yeah. I just, I just thought of one though. In addition, but last practical one because I get a lot of emails about this too. Are the crazy lights I have in my garage? They're LEDs. Oh, I'll yeah. put a picture here, but they're like they look like flowers, but they're loud. That loud. They're <laughs> bright as hell. Like they can. They, in my house, I have one fluorescent light, and then I just have the two lights in either of my garage door opener without adding jacks and wiring. And I am an idiot, so I'm not gonna do that. So I put uh, extensions from those. Ooh, you dropped your phone. Those uh, 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 those lights on the, the 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 garage door opener that hang down, and put those things on there. Yeah. <laughs> that looked inappropriate. <laughs> and uh, it really, it, like, I can film in here at night. I don't, but I can. So yeah. that's a really good one. And I'm gonna add one before we go to your last one. You give me the grand finale. I was gonna say they I make just, good runway lights too. Like if you want to pretend you're in a run. They're like, pretty. I'm a mo no. Yeah, you've never seen you do that. Okay. Um, the last one I is, I was just thinking of this. A membership to the local uh, uh, sort of motorcycle lobbying group. Okay. Right. So in Missouri, it was Freedom of the Road Riders, you know, that sort of stuff. And a lot of those memberships come with a small life insurance policy. That If you're looking for something that's just a, a nice, hey, you know, something, it's like down here, it's like 20 bucks uh, to join. But yeah, find your local motorcycle lobbying group. First off, they're doing great work for yeah. motorcyclists in your state, uh, helmet law stuff and profiling mm -hmm. and all that crap, which is really, really good use of time. But also, again, there's that little life insurance policy. So they're like 20 bucks. That's a good idea. And grand finale, I don't remember what it is. This is um, just to top everything off. Mm -hmm. It's a great stuffing, uh, stuffing stucker. Stuffing stucker. It's a stuffing stucker. It's a stocking, stocking. I can't speak. Stocking stuffer. Yeah, it's something you put inside for a gift. And it is a book, because reading's important, kiddos, on the world's greatest mullets. A book on the world's greatest mullets. Yeah, that was my... Was that a mic drop? Yeah, that was a mic drop. Did you see? Uh, yeah, a book on the world's greatest mullets. Yeah. Because everybody needs to know. Yeah. Now, I know... Is Dallas in it? Uh, he might be. He might be on the cover. You got to go to the link and find out. Because uh, I think it's worth He's checking out. He's not on the cover. But you should go check out... You Middle, don't know. Middle Tennessee Concrete. That's Dallas you baseball. You don't know. Yeah. So, yeah. maybe. So, right. check it out. That was my list. I thought it was a pretty concise. That's fantastic. All encompassing. I thought it was a great list. I, I apologize for taking the last 20 minutes from your life. Um, but <laughs> this was this was our legitimate ideas for you because it seems like everyone's out there looking for something to get. Yeah, we're always looking for great stuff. So love you all to death. Take care of each other. If you're not a subscriber, it means everything. If you hit subscribe, really appreciate it. Uh, we'll talk real soon. Bye.